All right, so it's another beautiful morning and we are at the Springfield Robertson County Airport. Getting ready to check out the airport. Uh, it's, essential, it's an essential activity, the airport, transportation, logistics, things of that nature. But it's also uh, a great opportunity to expand the mind. So we're gonna go here and check out the open house uh, for the, um, let's see if we catch that real quick. So I'm sure your local airport has local open house activities. So I'm always advocating for you to check them out, uh, especially when it comes to Robertson County, Davidson County. There's so much uh, growth going on in Davidson County. Robertson County, Montgomery County, uh, Cheatham as well. North, Dave, North Middle Tennessee is experiencing a lot of growth. So it's always important, especially uh, when you are in marketing, business development, things of that nature. Uh, even community relations to make sure you're staying ahead of the trends, uh, especially when it comes to housing, employment. Um, those are two biggest things, housing, employment, education. Gotta make sure you stay close to those trends. We're gonna go in here, check it out, um, see how things go. Let's go ahead and do it. We're coming to, as you know, the Springfield Robertson County uh, Airport Open House. Guess who I ran into? The man, the one that's holding it down, the individual, Mr. Ryan Martin, city manager for uh, the city of Springfield. Uh, he's hanging out with his family. We had to stop him, so thank you for joining us real yeah, quick. Donovan, sure. If you don't mind, what does this mean for the city? And uh, I know you're heading out. What was your thoughts, some of the experiences that you saw when it came to well, the residents? Well, this is a big day. This is a big deal because this terminal right back here just opened last year. So we've got a fairly a new terminal that we're showing off today. We want the public to see that. Um, big event, a big family event out here. We have uh, public safety people. Um, people have come in with their airplanes, different things. We just had jumpers land a few minutes ago. So it's a big deal for the community, nice community event. What we really want as a, as a uh, city's you know, investment into the airport, and the city and the county both jo uh, jointly own the airport. That's what we want people to see. We want people to know how the airport, what, how vital it is to our community, from our corporate traffic to our business and economy, what that means for everything. It's really a great thing. That's awesome. And all I can think about is economic growth. So I need everybody to start wrapping their minds around that topic of conversation. Thank you so much right. for just what you're doing. Thank you, we stand in agreement with you as far as just everything being smooth and easy money for your career and your personal life. Perfect. Thank and uh, so we'll much. get out here and enjoy. Thank you. Y'all have a good day. All right, Thank guys, you. let's go ahead and keep going. Let's check it out. Check it out. Good. So we're here with my friend, Officer Long, also a fellow partner as corporate ambassadors for the Ralph right. County Chamber. Uh, Officer, if you don't mind, what is your experience been so far? and what does this mean for the city? It means uh, it's kind of like it's a big experience for the city because it's drawn a lot of people here. There's people who have never been here before and everybody's really enjoying the air show so, and they're enjoying all the displays and everything they got. That's awesome. Appreciate so, you. We yes, got to check out the car. Check out the you, car. I know you have some swag if you don't mind. Oh, no, yeah, no, no. Show us what's going on. <laughs> That is a tight fit back there. Back seat of the police car. I want to get out of here. Very tight squeeze. Oh man, the Hiltons. Oh, Mom comes got us. What are they going to do? It's got these buttons on it. Oh man, and we got it by our own. One of our own got us. One of our own. No, you be quiet. Whoa. Thank you all for your service. Thank, Thank you for your service. Welcome. Thank you for your service. Thank you. 1 800 USA Army. 1 800 USA Army. Huge shout out to our servicemen and women out there. We stand in agreement with you as far as recovering. We pray it's easy money and you guys, you know, uh, that's a sticky situation, but at the same time, Technically, the service is the reason why individuals are able to experience the freedom that we have, easier said than done, that we have in this country. So that was a choice, you know, and uh, we just stand in agreement with all of our servicemen and women out there for the, putting their lives on the line. So if you want to make your mark and secure your future, go ahead and reach out to... Sergeant Williams. Sergeant Williams. Sergeant Williams. Sergeant Williams. Sergeant Williams. Sergeant Williams. Sergeant Guadalupe. And uh, what you end up needing at the minimum is your name, date of birth, your zip code, phone number, email address, and your area of interest, and you'll be on your way. 
Uh, I'll see if I can find any information to where they can uh, followers can reach out and, and, and you know possibly join the service. Um, if you don't mind, real quick, sorry for interrupting, sir. Uh, thank you for your service as well. Thank you for your service as well. I mean, it's just it's a lifestyle, and some things we just take for granted and we just don't know. I mean, I don't mean the touch situation, but we thank you. If you don't mind, what is it life? How's life in the fast line lane? What are some of the motivations to get started, and what are some of the lessons you can take out of, you know, uh, serving in a, and becoming a veteran? Uh, for me, one of the motivations was education. Mm. Um, pay for school, school's free, uh, 100%. Mm. So, uh, furthering my education and the discipline, uh, the life, uh, the, quality of life. How disciplined does it get? Yeah, because they have this thing called CP time. It's yeah. pretty, pretty disciplined. <laughs> that, does, that doesn't exist. Thank you for your service. It gets, service. Uh, it gets pretty, it's pretty disciplined. Yeah. Uh, you learn quick. Yeah, mm. hit times, and you got to mm. make your hit time. Yeah. Mm. Uh, we, we got a saying, right right time, right place, right uniform. As long as you do those three, wow. you can yeah, yeah, so You can almost apply those same lessons to life, though, would you say? Yep. Exactly. Mm. I always felt, this is a kind of controversial, but I, I, controversial to throw it out there, but I always felt maybe it's controversial, but some type of training in this regard, especially from like 18 to 20 year olds, maybe, kind of as they get, and then it's like a reserve type thing. I hate to say like, cause that's a whole different situation, but there's a lot of skills that you get that maybe you don't get in high school or early education, you know, even for myself, I could be wrong, but what's your thoughts on that? Controversial topic, but it's a, does that make sense? I mean, I, I, the freedom is, I appreciate the freedom, but there's some principles that maybe the young folks, including myself, we may not be able to grasp until, you know. Um, well, I, I, think, I think personally, it's all about your mindset. So mm. if, if you're going to receive that information, then of course, why not? But, but you know, on the other hand, you know, a lot of, a lot of people don't want to receive that information, so they're not going to put the best foot forward. So it really comes down to the individual, mm. what they want out of there. Yeah, and it's really, it's, it's beyond your, the individual. It's, it's really about the person to the left and right. Um, so it's not, it's, it's never about when you when being in really any branch. Um, it's never about the individual. It's always about this person and this person to the left and right. So those those type of things, uh, it, it, sometimes it's hard for people to, it's, it's a team. Yeah. Everything's a team. You can't we. No mission, nothing can be done without the team. So and a lot of people have, I think they might have a hard time understanding that it's bigger than yourself. It's bigger than yourself. That's a beautiful common ground too. And um, like I said, just uh, maybe, I don't know, we we'll just, we appreciate, you know, what you're doing and I want to get more kids involved at least. Do you guys have like youth programs or summer programs? That, or like um, a, we have the future soldiers training. Future soldiers uh, training, we're looking to that. work out with us and learn. Different things about the military. Are you guys based in Fort Campbell? Uh, we're actually recruiters uh, down in uh, Nashville. So in Galaxy. I gotta grab a car if you don't mind, because yeah, um, we do work in the national car. market. Yep. And um, I'm in Gallatin. Gallatin. Okay, that that'll work. This we do is come to you and make sure we can figure something out to stay engaged. Thank you so much. And uh, uh, thank you for your insight. Again, we stand in agreement. Thank you for your service. Absolutely. That's all. We can't say that enough. All right. Appreciate all right thank thank you. you as well, sir. This is how you know, this is how you know it's getting real when you pulling this out.
we're out enjoying a beautiful day of court at the Springfield Robertson County Airport. I'm here with the Honorable Miss Ma the Mayor of Coopertown, Miss Becca Warner, and she's been doing a great job in the city of Coopertown. This kind of a huge transition between uh, schools from Springfield to Coopertown. Did a yes. great job with that. If you don't mind, what does yes. the activity mean for Robertson oh, County and Coopertown? This is amazing. I I'm just so thrilled to be out here today and promote Robertson County and the aviation that's out here. We've got Music City Skydiving is a Coopertown business, wow. and they're their owners here that live here. And and I'm, you know, friends and working with a lot of the board members on trying to grow everything in Robertson County. And so we're just so honored to be out here today. That is awesome. So it's really good seeing you. Likewise, and just know we are here to help you wherever you need as well, far as the growth. You. And this is why it's so important that the economic growth, for everyone to be aware that yeah. uh, with the growth of Nashville, it's just how it goes. Yeah. It's yeah. coming to surrounding counties. It's nothing to do with anything but just growth. So be aware, be aware of this. If you happen to live within Robertson County, or area where there's growth as well as um, you know be engaged it's yeah. very important be That's engaged right. come on out to the airport today it's a great day and yeah grow in robertson thanks everybody thanks so much all right so we're going into the newly renovated building let's check it out That was a fun, full activity. A lot of energy was drained on that one as we engage. Engagement, engagement, engagement is so important. Without that, this way, Mikey, please. Engagement, engagement, engagement is so important. Without that, uh, really, it's hard to move anything forward. So engagement, education, stay, stay, uh, stay involved, ask questions, meet new people. Have a good one.